gonna try this again. Round two. Round two. Not Mr. Fitness two. Just round two. I don't know what happened. We we hit we, we hit the interchange where the sprint towers change over. And when they do, they throw everything off. So we're gonna see if we can get uh, JT Money back in here. And Christmas hat. He's got a nose, he's got the whole thing going. So we'll see if we can get him back in here because I think uh, we've got all sorts of shenanigans going on. getting ready to, he, he had told us what the definition of a poop show is, and uh, he was getting ready to talk to us about these uh, promos that made him an internet sensation in uh, Kansas wrestling, but, uh, and I'm getting all sorts of notifications, so we'll see if uh, he can jump back in here with us. Give him a little bit of time. See if we can uh, get him back in here. We got Casey Osborne watching. All the way from Wichita, Kansas. Wichita, Kansas Hall. As Larry King used to say. Or Keith Olbermann doing a really bad Larry King impression. Whichever. Whichever you prefer. I prefer Dana Carvey doing Ross Perot as to the actual Ross Perot. But uh, that's neither here nor there. That has nothing to do with uh, JT Money. Let's see if he can get in with us here. And uh, I think we, we're past the Sprint Towers. We're past all the nonsense. I think we're smooth sailing to Salina, Kansas. So we'll see if we get in here. And then it adds it. You gotta wait. Because then Facebook's gotta. <laughs> And there we go. We've got to the screen. Yeah. He's going to be on the side. I'm going to be on the side. You should get the bigger side of the video. There's a bigger star. Well, I wouldn't go too far, Jiggy. I wouldn't say that too much. Jiggy. Well, Jiggy, you're worldwide. Jiggy, you're worldwide, man. You're worldwide. Well, I'm going to go too far, Jiggy. I wouldn't say that too much. Jiggy. You're worldwide, man. You're worldwide. Well, uh, so, you know, you're going to have to be on the side. You're going to have to be on the side. You're going to have to be on the side. You're going to have to be on the side. You're going to have to be on the side. You're going to have to be on the side. You're going to have to be on the side. You're going to have to be on the side. You're going to have to be on the side. You're going to have to be on the side. You're going to have to be on the side. You're going to have to be on the side. You're going to have to be on the side. You're going to have to be on the side. You're going to have to be on the side. You're going to have to be on the side. You're going to have to be on the side. You're going Funny about that. You know, that was the first time the old funkster has ever pinned me before. That was the first time he ever beat me. Really? Really? Yeah. And that guy thinks he deserves a title shot? He was lucky. It was a fluke win. I had it. He rolled me up from behind. What kind of what kind of challenger does that? That's so, not how uh, big he uh, money fights. So, uh, are you well, I don't know. Is it is it really worth my time, or do I just go to the owner and say, "Hey, just give me a title shot. I'm JP Money." <laughs> you know, right? I could do that. I'm gonna let Outlaw have that hardcore title because I do not want nothing to do with that guy. Oh yeah. Yeah. Liam Knox, I feel sorry for that guy. Literally. Yeah, he did. Literally <laughs> and physically. <laughs> well, let's see. It all it all goes back to uh, well, where everybody started watching it on TV, you know, as little kids. <laughs> oh, well, this is hitting me up now. But, uh. So, uh. So, so, you. What was the first company or first place that you wrestled? And then eventually. Uh. Yes, I've. I've. I've wrestled. I've wrestled in Texas. I've wrestled in Oklahoma. I've. But I started off. Unfortunately, in XWE. But now we're in Kansas Wrestling Revolution. So uh, the opportunities for me are 
are, you know, they're on, yep. who knows what I could do in Kansas Wrestling Revolution. Look what I did in XWE. I went undefeated a whole calendar year. I am the best ever Liberty Champion they ever had. Yep, 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 yep. Like, I made that belt. And now some guy wants to prance around with it because it's got a, a makeover, it's got a facelift. I made that belt, buddy. That's awesome. That's fantastic. That's fantastic. So, uh, with, with, with the world title, in yes. Uh, a lot of people say that if I get the title, they can make the worst champion ever. According to what they're saying. Ow. If I get that title, you know what I'm going to do with that title. There's going to be people, too, making love to that belt. No, she one day will be my lady of gold, and no one will ever have stopped me on that. So, uh, now that you're, you're focused on that, are you done with that with the phone calling? No, Jimmy the Funk got a fluke win on me, so hopefully, instead of putting me in the rumble, but I know with management, they're going to want the main guy in the rumble. So, I, I would love to show everybody that it was a fluke win and that, that the Funk should have never beat me. He hit me with a, a schoolboy. He rolled me up. Like, no, that was a fluke win. It doesn't even count in my books. So, technically, I am still 4-0 against that guy. Oh, yeah, that was a fluke win. That was a fluke win. We don't count those in wrestling. So talk about running crazy. People that are living in the rock. Right? Money Crazy Inc. is two of the most powerful guys in wrestling. In Kansas wrestling right now, have put their put their their stuff beside. We have came together, and with Merrick McMichaels beside us, there's no way anybody can stop us. So, uh, are, 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 are you guys planning on just sticking it in the same revolution, or are you planning on going to go with the other indie companies and just basically... <laughs> Jiggy, I don't think other companies could afford Money Crazy Inc. Well, that's it. <laughs> yeah. I don't so, think other companies can afford us. Well, that I do not know. I Do I want to be a tag team champion? Not really. Do I want to be a world champion? Yes. So... It's whatever management wants to do. If they want to bring in tag titles, we'll carry around the tag titles, too. So, uh, talk to me about putting your differences aside and how you guys got together and did all that for people and people and people and people and Well, Mick Michaels came to me and he said, I got, I got, I got something for you, man. Let's bring this guy in. You know he's kind of crazy. He's kind of kind of a loose cannon. But when you guys are together, you guys win champions. You guys win championships everywhere you go. And that is a true fact. Me and Chris have won so many championships just between us that it's that's a great it's crazy. Yeah, I did the crazy thing and he's so oh, crazy. I love that. I love yeah, you know. That. I got. I gotta give my guy some credit. You gotta give my guy some credit. And, uh, I understand that uh, representatives 
Jimmy, you know it was a fluke win. You know you do not deserve to hold a victory over JP Money. Come on. Come on, man. Look at me. I got I, what's Jimmy got? Some dance moves? I lost to a guy that got dance moves. On a fluke a fluke pin. A fluke pin. Oh. Well, I see I see I see uh I still JC Thomas has joined yeah. us. You know what you know what's funny about that guy? You know what's funny about that guy? You can't even call him a smart. You know why? Because he's not smart. He's not smart at all, man. He says the same thing over and over and over and over and over and over again. Like watch, he'll say he'll say JT no money again. Watch, watch. Just watch. Oh yeah, oh yeah. He's, uh, he's, uh, I know, which I have nothing against that guy, you know, it's just, why does he like to hate on me so much? I give oh, back no. to the charity all the time. Right? I have, I have, after this, after this interview, I got to jump on my jumbo flight of